Okay. This game was made by 2K Australia, so I assume it wasn't too hard to find Australian voice actors. <laughs> oh, hello. Janie Springs. She looks happy. Black Marketeer, Heart of Gold. Alright guys, we are back. What is going on? This is Pern and Wolfie at By Wolfie Games, bringing you guys another gameplay of Borderlands the pre-sequel. This is the second episode, guys. I'm going to be making a ton of episodes, considering how huge this game is, and I can't wait to do it with you guys. Right now, we're just following Jack, continuing the mission that we did last time, and just knowing Borderlands, I guarantee you when I turn around, yep, there's going to be something right there for me. Pistols, nice. Explosive damage, though. Not really into that. We got a cool pistol here. I'll take that. Thank you. Oh, we got a really good pistol here. Okay, thank you very much. Awesome. Oh yeah, Jacobs. That's what I'm talking about. You're a cutie, Jack. All right, cool. Whoa, ballsy. Just jump down. No ragrets. Let's do this. Be cleansed with heat. Right. Uh, kill that guy, I guess. <laughs> Flame Knuckle, kill this guy with the arrow. <laughs> Thank you, Borderlands. Go. Why is he called saying son of a taint? What does that even mean? Kill the burning guy, kill the burning guy. I love Jack. Bang, 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 bang. See, so yeah, I'm definitely getting the Borderlands vibe. <laughs> they definitely didn't miss anything. Flame Knuckle, okay, that was just his shit. Oh, go oh, Joey, that's great. Why isn't he dying? Why isn't he dying? Ouchie. <laughs> Can you die now, dude? Oh my gosh. Where are all these enemies coming from? Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Yeah, I got a shield. Boom! 33 damage! Nice. Okay, okay, okay. We don't have no ammo. We have no ammo. Oh, jeez. Alright. Oh, that was easy. Headshots all day. Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's try to use our, our uh, special ability and see if that... Okay, never mind. <laughs> Apparently, we don't need it. Now we'll use it. Awesome. Can you melee while having this on? Oh yeah, you can. Eat it. That's damage to both of them too. That's awesome. She's such a cool character. I'm glad I chose Athena. Really likes fire. Elevators over there. Let's go. Thank you, Captain Obvious. Yeah. Our story just began with us getting off a bus. This is all explosive and stuff. Stop complimenting the prisoner. Oh man, I love Brick and Mordecai. Let's go, elevator. So I don't know if the uh, we can get the moonshot up there. story with the Lilith and them is like that they showed at the start is from like after Borderlands 2 or you know what I mean? I, I'm not really sure when the story takes place. I'm sure we'll find out eventually, but I assume they're just trying to figure out like why Jack did what he did to get into his like get into power and see what he knew. After they killed him, because they did kill Jack, this guy, in Borderlands 2. Which I can do right now! Ha ha! Game over. You guys never even played Borderlands 2, there's no point. I'm jumping. Watch your step, that'll be a hell of a fall. Roger. <laughs> Roger. Who's Roger? Alright, you get into the moonshot cylinder and we're right at I'm in, Jack. Hold on, I'm gonna spin the cylinder. You do that. I like how the character actually talks, that's pretty cool. Adds an extra element of awesomeness. Free up the elevator so I can join you. No, I don't want to. No way. Right on a white. She got wasted tight. Eh, no big deal though. <laughs> they can't feel pain. Just bash him out of there. Oh, there we the go. soldiers bummed me out. It's no wonder Dahl took us over so easily. I need more soldiers. Badasses. Like you. Uh, I'm scared of him. 
You're not a very nice man, you know that? And you're dragging your face along that wall right now. It's probably painful. You should probably stop doing that. Woo! We made it! Alright, we just gotta get into a moonshot. A crate of Hyperion shall not uh. after we kill this asshole! <laughs> <laughs> really? Just one guy? Alright, that's twice. I used to that from Borderlands. Uh, now we just gotta. Oh, for what the, the auto shock controls are damaged. Someone's got to stay back and launch the pods manually. All right. I'd suggest Athena, but I need John Elpis. You're the only person that I can trust to save the space station. Roger. I'll find a way to save Helios. You won't have died in vain. If you die. All right. New plan. I'll stay behind. I need you down on the moon. You gotta find that jamming signal and shut it down. Otherwise, we'll never get control of the moon base and we can kiss that vault goodbye. Right. You're really staying? You'll likely die. Now you saved my life a couple of times. I'm repaying the favor. <laughs> Besides, I'm a hero, baby. Self-sacrifice is part of the job. <laughs> this is cool. So I wonder if the dialogue of the I characters like here, changes. Uh, had an accident and uh, lost his torso. Better heal up before your trip down to the moon. <laughs> Might I wonder if Jack's dialogue so will change here. because of my dialogue or Claptrap's dialogue or the other characters' here, dialogue. Normally, dialogue. Supplies, oh, cool! Chest. Time, you're the <clears throat> Treasure chest. Treasure chests are among the best places to find the rarest loot. The colors indicate the rarity of an item. The color scale from at least rare to most rare goes white, green, blue, purple, orange, pearlescent. If they still have it. Um, okay. Pistols, pistols, pistols. Mostly what you normally find at the start of a Borderlands game. Not gonna lie. Um, okay, this okay. container ought to do the trick. Now we get to get shot down to the moon. This will be fun. Come on, let's go. Hmm. Hurry up, Jack. So the container's all ready. Just get into it. Does oh, this, this container? Cool. I'm closing the container. Watch your limbs. Loading you <laughs> to the delivery chamber. This is gonna be loud. It's slightly awesome. You're telling me, Jack, handsome Jack, the guy who murdered my boyfriend, stayed behind while you. It is after Borderlands like 2. Hell. Whether his decision was heroic or purely strategic, I can't say. But if Jack hadn't stayed behind to eject the pod, I might well have died on Helios. <laughs> Your story is making handsome Jack kind of sympathetic. <laughs> I hate it. All Me right, too. we're ready to fire. Whenever you're ready, I'll shoot you to Concordia. It's the biggest town on Elpis. I know someone there who can help you find that jamming signal. Ah, <sighs> this is going to be fun. I love all the cutscenes. This is awesome. All oh, this cool stuff going on. There he is! Open fire! Oh crap! <laughs> I like his little guns. They're cool. Like his wrist guns, just pew pew. He just shot us out of a cannon. A crate to the moon. From space. There we are. Who's that? It looks like Tiny Tina. Oh man, I wouldn't be running towards that. I'd be crapping myself. <laughs> it's pretty ballsy, though. Cool. All right. Hello. 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 Hi. I thought you might be salvage. You're about to die. Oh. You okay? Well, I can answer that. You're not okay. The second you open this door, all the oxygen is going to vent and you're going to suffocate. It'll hurt a lot and your eyes will pop like grapes when the pressure differential gets too harsh. Nice. So, here's my plan. When you're ready, open the door and follow me to my oxygen bubble. Sound good? Don't answer. Conserve your oxygen. Okay. This game was made by 2K Australia, so I assume it wasn't too hard to find Australian voice actors. <laughs> Oh, hello. Janie Springs. She looks happy. Black Marketeer, Heart of Gold. She looks nice. Over here. 
Hi. How am I breathing? Press M to access your map. The map shows you many different points of interest as well as the specific location of your waypoint. I don't want to... Okay. It made me. I didn't have a choice. Am I, like, dying? What's going on? Do I have it? No, I don't even have a helmet. Look at me. I'm gonna die. Am I supposed to be alive right now? This way. Don't think about the grapes thing. <laughs> I'll try not to. Oh, the gravity! What is this? Oh, that's so cool. Okay. I'm trying to breathe here. That's so cool. I can breathe. The gravity's still weird. I like the gravity. How high can we exactly jump? Whoa. She jumped that whole distance and I can't? Find some O2. Find some O2. That means oxygen. It'd be embarrassing if you died now. Yeah, it would be pretty embarrassing. I wonder if I get an achievement or something. I feel like that would be something Borderlands would do. Die at the very beginning. Here's an achievement. Are you coming? Where are you? Where'd you go? Oh, it's down here. Oh, I'm stuck. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Oh, we made it. Okay, we're safe. Everybody good? Nice to meet ya. I'm Janie Springs. Hi, Springs. Who are you? I'm Athena. Well, hello. So what are you doing here? <laughs> okay. We need to get back to Helios Station, but we can't until we take down a jamming signal somewhere on this moon. A jamming signal? Haven't noticed anything like that. You might want to get to Concordia, a little city run by a fella called the Merif. Got to be somebody there who can help you. You'll need an O2 kit, Oz kits we call them, to survive the journey though. I've got some broken ones stashed nearby, but I can repair them for you. Even if you ain't the breathing type, you'll be glad you've got an Oz kit. <laughs> Head to these coordinates and clear the place out. Even if you aren't the breathing type, I assume she's talking about Claptrap. Cool, okay. Uh, I guess we gotta go get that Oz kit. And then I guess we'll probably come back here. This looks like kind of a meeting little spot. Vehicles, it looks like that would be a vehicle station. I'm super excited about the vehicles in this game. They're different from Borderlands 1 and 2. And they look kind of hovery. And it looks pretty awesome. And I still have no air and I'm probably going to die. I don't know what these are over here. Probably some air ventilation things? I don't know. <gasps> yeah. It's probably a little bit of breathing stuff for me. Joking. <coughs> Joking. <laughs> air. There's your air. Come on, we're almost there. Just keep breathing, just keep breathing. You can do it. Come on, what's this? Cool, we got some health. So now if we die, we'll die healthy. That building used to be in one piece Ooh. and not lava adjacent. Till the crackening anyway. Oh, we're good, okay. Got this. Oh man, Kraken! What the heck is that? Crack Kraken? Kraken? No coming back from that. Yeah, that's definitely Kraken. <laughs> wanna mess with me? You wanna mess with me? Oh, I don't even wanna mess with me. What the heck? I kill one and like four spawn. Get out of here. I'm gonna stab you. Get out of here. Alright. What's this? What the heck? Oh, this, okay. Alright, that didn't oh, work. I forgot I locked it. Whoops. Just Good punch job. off the locks with your meat hunks. That's moon for hands. <laughs> your meat hunks. Ah, this pistol's so much better. <laughs> Don't you guys agree? What the heck? Why are there so many spawning? Okay, I'm just gonna jump up here and do this. Slice and dice. Slice and dice. And now I'll kill these guys. Bring it! Oh, that was a dirty... Protect me, man! Oh, yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, man. I'm burning. I'm burning. I'm burning. Get the health. Okay. Okay, don't die. Don't die. <laughs> this is cr This is nuts! Okay, I didn't know there was four. I thought there was only two. Now we know. We should learn to read. Did you kill all those baddies for me too? Not excited about being mauled again. Oh my gosh. More? 
get out of here. Yeah, stupid thing. Her cooldown's really short on that action hey. skill. Just sweet. Oh, cool. We got a loot box over there. One Ozkip. Great for breathing, double jumping, and slamming enemies. Slamming enemies? Look, to double jumping? To saving your life, you're gonna end someone else's. His Ooh, name's Deadlift. Right he's nearby, and he's an asshole. He's also got something I'll need to get us into Concordia. You cleared the place out? I'm coming down. Just bring the broken Ozkip uh, to me, and I'll not feeling that weapon. I don't like explosive weapons, guys. Okay, um, let's go back across. <laughs> How do we double jump? I'm as dry as a... F well, I'm pretty dry. Well, I'm pretty dry. Deadlift leads a band Spring of scavengers Oz and scavs. Oh, you, you get different Oskits, cool. Dig site? Colonel Zarpadon imprisoned them, but they escaped when Dahl's digging cracked the moon. Zarpadon. Anyway. Am I wearing my Oskit? I don't know. Whatever. Digistruct key for my Zoomy stations. Killing him will get. I need you to help me make some inspirational posters. Oh, I'm gosh. sorry. Did my accent throw you off? I meant to say, I need y'all to help me fix up some inspirational <laughs> posters, y'all. Donuts, cowboy cowboys, homophobia. They sell like hotcakes on the black market, and I've already run out of kitten posters. Was hey, she being racist? I don't know. She was being something there. She was. She was just. It's out of line. Active mission, you can now work on more than one mission at a time. Yes, I can. Thank you. We're going to do every mission, guys. We're not just going to do single missions. We're going to do as many missions as we can. So let's not skip awesome things like the Hails from Elpis. Okay, are we in Serenity's Waste right now? Yes, we are. And our objective is right there. So let's check this one. Okay, so this one's closer. We'll do this one first, and then we'll do Land Among the Stars. Let's go. I got bored one day and started writing children's books, but I lost them. Can you find them for me? You could totes give me some feedback, too. I could totes do that for you. Totes. <laughs> Butt slam! Oh! Oh, man! Holy crap, those guys are big. Those guys are big. Oh, my gosh. Haha, <laughs> I like this gravity stuff. Nothing can kill me. Want to get butt slammed? Is that what you're asking for? Come here, butt slam! Oh man, I bet you everyone's just sat here and just butt slammed everything. They haven't even done anything for the campaign or the story or anything. They've just been butt slamming the whole entire game. Butt slam! Come here. Oh jeez. Okay, those guys just blow up. Get out of my face. I don't like you. I don't like any of you. Uh, press I to access the inventory in your Echo device. Okay. Alright, let's check this out. What is that? That's a blue weapon. Oh, cool. Okay. Six times eleven. No. Our pistols. That's the one we had at the start, I assume. I wonder why I got a blue weapon right at the start of the game. Personal journal? The heck? Okay. So that's the offer. I know you're a certified badass and everything, but I need to know you're not going to run out on me before the job's through. If you hire me, you aren't paying for another merc with a gun. You're paying for decades of experience. You're paying for professionalism. You're paying for loyalty to the mission above all else. Yeah? That way, yeah. Told General Knox. <laughs> Loyal to the mission is one thing. Loyal to people is something else. Hmm. I like my character. She seems really cool. Alright, we're here. Pick up Echo Story. Which is right down there. This could be fun. Alright, here we go. Let's grab it. Once upon yeah, a time, we got it. There was this moon. Good job. And some military dudes came and started mining. They delved all deep and greedy and crap. Moon I do have a double open, jump. People died. No one lived happily ever after. Finn, what do you think? Not enough plot. <laughs> I'll take it under advisement. I think there might be another one in my old camp. It got overrun by Kragans. Killed my... They killed her. Killed your what? Are you a lesbian? Did they kill your girlfriend? Oxygen levels at 50% and dropping. Okay. Thank you, game. Oxygen levels at 50%. You're probably gonna die in a second. Up, up, up we go. Double jump. So the double jump's not really a double jump. It's more like a double dash, I guess you could say. 
We got a skill point too, I'm not gonna upgrade it quite yet. I'm gonna wait. Which there's no point to, but we might as well just wait. I don't know exactly what kind of character I want to be, I haven't looked at all of our skill points. Oh jeez. Accept the health! Take the damage! Stab stuff! I wanna go there? Get out of my face. Alright, let's check that now. What are we freaking out about? Characters like you. <gasps> that was easy. There once was a kraken named Flamey, who jumped out of the crack and bit Janey. She blew off its face. Now there's no trace hear that. of the kraken who dared such cockamamie. Oh, well, cockamamie. Dark, yet satisfying rhyme scheme. I like it. Fair enough. Good feedback. Oh, that reminds me though, Flamey's son owes me a life and he's still out there. Track him down and get it for me, yeah? Okay. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Alright, well I'm going to check out my skill points really quick here. And then... Ooh, we get badass rank. Let's redeem some tokens. Gun damage. Really damage. Maximum health. Gun damage. We're all about that damage and health. Um... Recoil reduction is nice. Reload speed is nice. Melee damage is awesome. Maximum health is even better. That was a mistake. <laughs> I clicked the wrong one. Um, gun accuracy, okay. How many of these do I got? Maximum health. Four more tokens, okay. Um, gun accuracy. Maximum health. Let's be a tank. Maximum health. Gun damage. So maximum health above all else, basically. That's how I'm doing this. Okay, so this one. My skills. Cool. So this one's gonna be more about being quick and being like kind of like slash uh, with the sword and the melee, um, which looks pretty cool. But um, I want to check out the other ones as well. So we got storm weaving. This one is Chironic storm. Uh, storm weaving. When you swap weapons, you gain storm weaving, increase your fire rate, uh, and elemental effect. Okay. Incendiary, incendiary, <laughs> or shock damage causes you to uh, gain stacks of maelstrom. All elemental damage dealt is increased for the stack of the maelstrom. Stacks will decay over time. Cool. All right. Uh, this looks like more elemental stuff. You generate percentage of your shields every second for each stack of maelstrom. Da -da -da. Okay. Uh, while you are airborne, shooting an enemy with smite will smite them, causing incendiary and shock damage in a small area. My damage increases as you accumulate more stacks of maelstrom. This ability has a cooldown. Cool. Alright, um, unrelenting kill skill. Killing an enemy, increase your weapon swap speed and fire rate for each stack of maelstrom. Good. Zeus Rage. When you throw the Aspis, a lightning devastating fire and lightning storm will spawn at the target location doing area damage for several seconds the damage of the storm increases based on the amount of damage absorbed by the aspis cool elemental so it kinda looks a lot like shock and fire damage which is pretty sweet overload when you kill an enemy who is electrocuted or burning there's a chance for the status effect to chain to a nearby enemy cool uh... whatever freeze an enemy you gain flash freeze for a short duration during this time you cannot gain or lose maelstrom shock slamming links you to nearby enemies with a shock tether for a short duration electrocuting them the tether is broken if you lose line of sight to your target any enemy still tethered at the end of the duration or who die while tethered release an incendiary nova cool awesome that looks that's pretty sweet and then we got this over here I wonder what this is so while the aspis is active you and your nearby enemies gain health okay so it's kinda like a um, just damage dealt by the aspis when thrown increased movement speed and gun damage uh, lengthens the duration of the aspis can be active before it is automatically thrown aspis now stores the elemental ty damage type of absorb damage that's cool can be stored in all stored damage types are dealt by the aspis when thrown when thrown the aspis explosion grants second wind to f friends with range wow within range. In addition, you gain a damage bonus while on fight for your life. That's pretty cool. Huh. Okay. Um, damage absorbed by the Aspis now provides power to the shields of you and your nearby friends. So this is kind of like the support class, I guess you could say. It allows the Aspis to absorb a percentage of damage from your friend's guns, also increasing your maximum health. 
Uh, if you make the Aspis taunts nearby enemies, make them more likely to attack you additionally for every individual enemy who inflicts damage on your Aspis, you gain a stack of Prepare for Glory. Increase your gun damage stack persist for a short duration after the Aspis has been thrown. When active, the Aspis has a chance to reflect incoming lo lasers and bullets while still absorbing their energy. The Aspis will ricochet up to four additional enemies, each taking less damage than the last. The Aspis will return to you after it hits the final enemy. Okay. <coughs> So guys, after doing a little breakdown of all these, I have found out that this one right here is more of your melee and your sword, kind of like a gladiator type class, which looks pretty cool. And uh, you get some health regeneration and some melee. Uh, your melee with your sword is going to be stronger. Another thing here, guys, this is more of your elemental kind of shock and awe damage. You you get um, electric damage and you also get fire damage too as well, which looks really cool and really interesting. Frost damage too right here. So that looks um, if you guys are into the elemental more damagey type. Of character that's the one you'd want to go for Athena and then we also have over here this is kind of like your support class but all at the same time making your Aspis which is your action skill be a little more uh, stronger and a little more effective so this one looks pretty cool and I think just from kind of seeing this and seeing um, how this one looks over here I think I kind of want to do the left one and the center one just so I have that melee damage and then I also have at the same time I'll have that um, aspis damage so I'll kind of be like a, shor a sword and a shield type character which looks pretty cool I'm gonna start out maybe using my uh, melee and just seeing how that looks so far so right here we got increased gun damage additionally your melee damage is increased for a short duration after shooting an enemy and then increased melee damage and maximum health as well so I think we're going to do this first and then our melee damage is going to be a little stronger so we're basically going to be uh, tanky but at the same time we're going to have that kind of strength with our melee damage so let's give it a shot see how it works oh that looks like an enemy Okay. what the heck was that Oh, a little one. Get out of here. My melee damage is strong now. The force is strong with me. Come on, hit me. Hit me, buddy. Come on, do damage. Boom, in the face. Ooh, butt slam. Butt slam. Oh, man. Okay, this guy's going down. I'm not messing around here, man. Goodbye. Vengeance. Look, he must have eaten the lot. This one is called Baby Kragen Goes on an Adventure. Baby Kragen crawled out of the grandson of Flamey. <laughs> they saw strange two legged creatures and thought they must be food. So Baby Kragen and his mum raided the camp. Flamey tore a two legger up pretty bad, and Baby Kragen killed another one. Then Baby Kragen ran away like a little b stupid piece of sh. <laughs> that one something. I don't know. Bring those back while I write another one. <laughs> Baby Craig. An evil fire <laughs> oh my Please gosh. Do not. This game is so funny. I love it. <laughs> she ran away like a little bitch. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, that's hilarious. This game is beautiful. Alright. So, so far guys, I think this game is absolutely amazing. And it is pretty freaking funny. A word that rhymes with orange. <laughs> Some publishers are interested, but it's only if I cut out the parts where people. And <laughs> I don't even want to hear what she had to say. Kragans die. Oh, okay. I was like, nah. Alright guys, well I'm going to end this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's been a ton of fun playing Borderlands pre-sequel so far. This is after all the second episode. I am going to be making a ton more episodes guys, so stay tuned because there's a lot more content coming your way. Thank you so much again for watching guys. You guys are the best players in the world and peace.